What you're seeing here is a model, specifically of carbon dioxide moving through the atmosphere, driven by wind patterns and circulation. To create this model, billions of data points informed by data collected from satellites and ground-based measurements were run through powerful supercomputers to scale observed behavior to a global stage. What makes this model stand out is that it's super high resolution, 128 times higher than a typical weather model and 500 times higher resolution than a typical climate model. This means we could focus on individual points like power plants and forest fires and see in extreme detail how these plumes move and get mixed in the atmosphere. Now, why is this important? Because by creating these high-resolution models, NASA scientists are able to better understand the behavior of Earth's interconnected systems, like how plumes of CO2 interact and spread with weather systems. For instance, you can clearly see the impact the day-night cycles have on CO2 emissions. This is due to daily fluctuations in human activities, cycles of photosynthesis, and fires flaring up and dying down. Our ability to run such a simulation allows us to see how individual data points influence the larger picture, uncovering previously unknown atmospheric relationships, and help us better understand the complexities of our atmosphere.